Hello everyone, so I was able to attend a screening of Land. This is a new film that stars and is directed by Robin Wright. I've been a big fan of her performances for years. I think she's a really, really good actress, and this is her first time in the director's seats. And this is a movie about a brave woman who seeks out a new life way off the grid in Wyoming. It's the first time she's ever been alone and first time you can tell she's ever really had to use any survival skills. So she goes in pretty raw and unexperienced into the situation to basically, like I said, just come to terms with her past and start a new life for herself. So without further ado, let me get into my review for Land. So as I said, Robert Wright's character in this movie is dealing with a lot of grief and the way that she has to deal with this is proving to herself, her past, her losses that she can be on her own. So she does that by secluding herself, buying land in Wyoming that's way off the grid, no one near her and trying her best to, sorry my puppy's eating a blanket, <laughs> basically just trying her best to live off the land. So she does this too by stockpiling a few items that she's going to need before she learns how to hunt, fish, get water, do all these things. And a lot of it is her own personal struggles with just having to fend for herself for the first time and it gets really tough for her. She finds out that this just isn't working for her, maybe she's not cut out for it, but thankfully for herself she does get a little bit of help you very good people who add quite a bit to the story add a lot of depth to her grief her sorrows her past and also to just her own strength and how sh good she is at learning and coming to terms with everything she did and living with people again for one of the first times in her life or wanting to live with people and i felt that the relationship between her and mostly there's two characters who come in to help her but one in particular who does a lot for her character and brings out a lot of goodness in her and a lot of character development for her which was very very much needed and it was really sweet their relationship together. The cinematography in this movie is very very well done. Robin Wright did a fantastic job just seeing all the shots of beautiful Wyoming in terms of just like that cinematography and landscaping. But all the scenes too where she's fending against nature, fending against the elements even too when she's just fishing, everything's shot really, really nicely and it's not just highlighting very beautiful and pretty environments, it's also showcasing her character in the environments, what she's thinking, how she's grieving, how she's learning. It just does a really good job with having the land be a character who's also working against and eventually with Robin Wright's character and I did really enjoy that. She did a very good job for her first time behind the director's seats. And I can see in the future her becoming a very good director of really like grounded and down to earth dramas. The span of this movie is about two years long and the movie is just a little under an hour and a half so I felt like sometimes her past and even to her growth in just terms of survival isn't as flushed out as it could be. This movie could have used a little more time, maybe a little more dramatic set pieces and just experiences for her to learn through to fully develop her character because I found a lot of the time her actions were extremely selfish and by the end of the movie she does get a little better but I felt like a few more experiences with the elements herself, her past would have flushed out this movie a little more and made her character a lot more likable by the end of the film. Not that she isn't when she gets there, it's just really tough to watch her essentially almost be out there to die and leaving what she did in order to do this sometimes felt extremely selfish to me and sometimes when you're watching a character that you can't relate to or even in many cases root for it sometimes becomes a bit of a drag and I did feel this in this film but by the end of it it wraps up very nicely very beautifully and it starts off a new life for her that I'm excited for the character to finally adjust to things be one with herself get over everything that she's had to and it was like I said just very very good for her again like all the animals in this movie looked fantastic just a great directorial debut and sometimes it, well, it could be a little slow, a little empty. There was a lot of really, really good subtle acting where Robin Wright's performance was very, very, very well done and you could just tell everything that she was thinking by walking through the woods, fishing, um, surviving the elements and just all her facial expressions, body movements were putting all the words in her mouth where she didn't have to say anything and I find the performances like that are always pretty stellar and 
I can easily attribute that to her performance in this movie. So of all of this taken together, Land is a pretty good film and that is why I'm going to give it a final score of 6 out of 10. So in the comments down below, let me know if you've seen Land and what you thought about it. And of course, if you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up and check out everything else that I do on this channel and all my movie reviews through my description down below. There's also a link to my Twitch down there. And of course, if you like what you see and when you do all of that, you can subscribe and turn the little ringer on if you want to know when I upload new videos. But yes, awesome guys, go check out Land. It is about an hour and a half long and just awesome guys.